Hi friends, welcome to Deliciously Jabas. Put the baking sheets away and grab your skillet for an ultimate crowd pleaser today, which goes by the name Skillet Cookie. First start by taking a cup of maida, half a teaspoon of baking powder, quarter teaspoon of baking soda and quarter teaspoon of salt in a mixing bowl. Mix this using a fork or a spoon until they are well combined. It's nice and done, keep this aside. Now, I am taking a 6 inch cast iron skillet pan. If you don't have a skillet pan, you can use ceramic or glass or any metal baking dish of your choice. Now, I am taking 110 grams of butter. and melt the butter on a stove top. Once the butter is melted, don't stop. Continue heating until you get the butter to a rich brown color. You don't want to burn the butter. The key here is knowing when to stop. And when you can't see anything but bubbles, it's time to switch off the flame. This is the perfect color that I need. Remove it from the flame and cool it to room temperature. Now, preheat the oven at 180 degrees Celsius for 20 minutes and meanwhile, in a separate bowl, take two heaped tablespoons of sugar, half a cup of light brown sugar and the melted brown butter. This brown butter will add a rich nutty flavor to the dish, you know. Beat this mixture for 5 minutes or until they are well combined and the sugar is completely dissolved. You know you can mix this in the skillet pan itself and for the video's sake I am using a mixing bowl here. Next add an egg and keep whisking for another 2 minutes or until the mixture reaches a caramel like consistency. It will smell like toffee you know. For the written recipe, please visit my blog at www.deliciouslyjabas.com and I will leave the link below in the description box for you. Now it is nice and done. Add the dry ingredients to this mixture. Then. Add a teaspoon of vanilla essence and again mix it well. The real beauty behind this 5 star dessert is that it can be prepared ahead of time. Mix up the dough, get it into a greased skillet, then pop it into the fridge. About 45 minutes before you want to serve it, pop the skillet into the oven and bake it for 15 minutes and serve warm with vanilla ice cream for your guests. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up button. Now, add half a cup of milk chocolate and quarter cup of dark chocolate and combine them well. I like this chocolate combo. If you wish, you can either Use complete milk chocolate or complete dark chocolate. It's up to your preference. Please try this recipe and share your experiences in the comment section below. Now, transfer this dough to the skillet. You can follow me on Facebook and Insta and I leave the link below for the same in the description box. Even out the dough. and place a few chocolate chunks on the top of the dough to make it more attractive. Do not forget the last part. Sprinkle some sea salt flakes 
and this makes the dish from amazing to oh so 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 spectacular it's time to pop the skillet into the oven and bake it at 180 degree celsius for 12 to 15 minutes only watch the sides of the cookie it will become golden brown and slightly crispy the center will remain slightly gooey because that's what makes any chocolate chip cookie so dang good after 15 minutes remove the skillet from the oven and have a spoon ready to dig in serve it warm topped with a scoop of vanilla ice cream you know the warm gooey chocolate the chewy cookie topped with vanilla ice cream is like the ultimate combination if you are new to my channel do subscribe and hit the bell icon for further notifications of my new video uploads i'll meet you with another delicious recipe and until then it's jaba signing off bye bye